Thank you. Uh, my name is Commander Tony Chiritelli. Um, I'm in charge of the Southern District Police. Um, as you're aware, an uh, investigation is underway in relation to an incident that occurred in Buckman's Bay overnight, which resulted in a police officer discharging his firearm. At 1am, police responded to a stolen motor vehicle driving erratically in the Kingston area. The report of the groom Ford Festiva motor vehicle uh, was that vehicle involved. Short time later, the vehicle was located in a dead end in Crispin Downs and drive in Blackman's Bay. When one of the police officers exited the passenger side of the police vehicle, the driver of the stolen vehicle turned the vehicle in the direction of the police, the police officer and the motor vehicle and drove directly at him. As a consequence of um, the level of force that uh, was believed by the police officer, the police officer drew his firearm and fired at the vehicle. Unfortunately, um, whilst there was, a, there was a, a degree of force, force by, used by police, this didn't stop the vehicle from hitting the police officer. Fortunately, this resulted in a minor leg injury. However, he was taken to the hospital and treated there. Uh, that police officer has now been discharged. It was later established that uh, the driver of that vehicle was a 17 year old youth. He left the scene and abandoned the vehicle in Wattle Avenue, Kingston. He was located by police a short time later and was taken to hospital with an injury to his head. Um, we're not sure at this stage whether that injury was as a result of uh, the crash that he had with that vehicle uh, and the police vehicle or whether it was uh, part of um, shrapnel from the uh, police uh, discharged um, firearm. There were no other passengers in that stolen vehicle.